wars, as chronicled in Orgasm again, our heroes, the immortal warriors and part-time rock gods, war, have returned to their Antarctic strongholds to regroup and tend their roots. But the forces of man have taken this moment of weakness to nurture all their Sarge, I got a bad feeling about this. Shut up, Rizzo! Take your position like a bitch. Remember, no one fires until I give the word. Sarge! Sarge! Something's coming! Take cover!
raid against us, or, or is it a raid or a raid? We should have had sex with dolphins. That's right! Now, we have to repopulate the entire world! Quick, to the dolphin rape cave! <laughs> Fuck! Ah! 
you hear that? It's like a fly. Where, where is that thing?
may not have heard this, but that's all right. You see, even though you don't know our name, you already love us. We make the food you eat, we make the clothes you wear, we make the car you drive, we put a roof over your head, and make the pillow you lay it on at night. You may not make the water you drink, but we have the fluoride and estrogen-like chemicals to keep you healthy and docile. And we put it in non-biodegradable bottles that make your landfills the towering mountains of majesty that will one day cover the world. But we don't just make things. We're doing things, too. We're building the skyscrapers in your cities and setting the fictional prices for your health care. We run your armies and control your politicians. Yes, we're the one person and we own everything you want. But don't think of us as stodgy old white things. Look, we employ a couple ethnically diverse brown people and pay them almost 70% of the living wage. So no matter what you're doing or where you're going, we'll be there. Because we're not going to stop until we own every goddamn thing on this planet. And speaking of God, we just purchased the Catholic Church and are in the process of forming a major religion merger. So there's no use praying to Him. We're gone, and we own you.
have not been listening. You need to do what your bosses say. The first thing we need to do is get rid of all the aliens. It's going to be a huge job. It's okay. going to be huge. Okay, Trump, you know, excuse me, horse face. Let me tell you something. We are aliens, you do realize that. I think the problem is that you're fucking racist. Not true, not true, very unfair. I mean, I love the Sp uh, Hispanics. Okay. I love Muslims. I even love the Nick. Oh, you cannot. What is wrong with you? That will be quite enough, puppet. Whoa. You have all the freedom you want to indulge yourselves in rock and roll decadence. But if you step out of line and embarrass Glompo, we'll wine steam your ass. I'm gonna take a sip of water, 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 I'm gonna take a s
that's all good, man. I can you know, all those guys in here, a real handful. Not to worry, though. I got a deal for me. Ruin the buying back for a whole dog. Yeah, look at that. Fresh, crisp, right off the press. No new guy, either. It's kind of cheap. Give me yours. It's yet right now. Meanwhile, Bova, I'm putting you in control. You're president now. Don't do anything stupid. Like, you know, big fight with the NFL. Those fuckers are huge. Well, that's all I gotta say now. Get back to work and make me some goddamn money. <laughs> Did you hear that? I, the Berserker Bova, am now president of the United States of America. That's amazing. Give him a hand, everybody. That's an accomplishment. Yeah, that was a good achievement. Wow, congratulations, both of them. Now that you're president, I think you should nominate me, Beefcake the Mighty, as Secretary of Snacks. I'm the man for the job. Secretary of Snacks. Hold on, hold on. Snacks, snacks. Snacks. Okay, wait a minute. I'm getting a presidential alert on my phone. It says, shut the fuck up. I didn't even vote for you. Look, you remember earlier in the show when you were like, we need to like, repopulate the earth by fucking dolphins and stuff. Yeah. And all, I was doing that a long time ago, and I've got these massive child support debts that I'm not going to pay because I'm not going to be in my fucking dad. Go fuck the stuff, kids. You mean, anyway, dolphins collect child support payments? Yes, look at them. They look weird. But look, we can fix all that if you use your presidential power to raise the abortion age to 21 years old. Okay, so wait a minute. Let me get this straight. You want it to be legal to abort a child up until that child's 21st birthday? Yeah! Yeah! Of course. Yeah! Yeah! You know, everybody's got to stand for something. I think that it's time we made America guar again. Oh! 